We're living during one of the largest humanitarian crises in the world. Being able to affect as many people as we have here, that's just powerful. Part of the emergency unit at the ARC sent to Greece to assess and provide life-saving support to refugees. This is 30 days worth of uh, arrivals on this gigantic mound. Can you imagine eight months? There were boats coming in day or night, carrying 50, 60, 70 people each, having survived this hellish trip to face chaos. We were a handful of volunteers and some NGOs trying to provide basic stuff such as food, dry clothes, medical attention. And these people were totally helpless. Information was so scarce, they were full of anxiety of what comes next, you know, they had this first big step achieved, and then uncertainty. It was incredibly important to be here, to see what was happening on the ground. There were people carrying their children, a um, few of their personal belongings, uh, but what was interesting to see that many of them were holding uh, phones, mobile phones. And we thought, well, maybe we could use our technology with the IRC and Mercy Corps' understanding of the crisis itself in order to give the refugees the information to stay safe. So together we made Refugee Info Hub. It's a mobile site that gives refugees information like where to get medical attention, um, how to find refugee camps, and anything else needed, all in their own language. When we went live, it was powerful. What would take a few days, now it's a matter of minutes. What we started here, delivering life-saving information through technology, I think that's going to be the norm in the future. And the amount of people that we've touched is, is incredible.